Hey guys, welcome back to another video. Now today, we here are the race highlights for the 2022 Thanksgiving 3.30. I mean, the 3... The 30.0. So I just did a hosted race, and... Yeah, so it was called the Thanksgiving 30.0, and it was 30 laps, but it went into overtime. So I started 4th place. And then this guy... He started first place on the pole position. So then this is us coming to green. I was 34 laps. Right there I'm in fourth place in my own hosted event. So the pace car just goes off and then we went racing immediately. So he runs off with the lead early, but then the pack catches up. Then the three car gets a push from the purple car. I don't know his number. So then I gave the four car a push, and then we had a huge run from the back. There was some contact there, and then I have a huge run right here. His car was kind of blinking as well. So I was second place that lap and then the four car made a huge save back there and then I bumped him out of the way for the lead. He almost went four wide there. So then yeah, it was just intense pack racing the whole race. So then I make a move on the inside through the grass. But I did not get the pass like Dale Earnhardt did. So then the three clears us all on the outside. So in the middle of the corner, the inside has the advantage. But on the corner exit, the outside gets a huge run. As you can see with that purple car. So then I push the three car right here. And then that's the first crash of the race. On lap three. I just did a bad push on the three car. And then... The then he goes to the outside, gets hit, and then they just beat and bang off each other, and then that was a huge crash. Well, damage was disabled, so then the caution... So they were back in contention for the race. I started on the... I started first place and had a huge run. I mean, a huge launch off the start, but then the eighth car just caught up to me. And then he slingshotted. The 5 made a huge move on the outside, but then the 3 made a move, and the purple car pushed the 3 car. They just block, and then... Yeah, still some intense pack racing. I get, I get a push from the 3 car. Then I... Oh wait, I forgot. I hit the wall right here and then I fall back. Oh wait, that's not the part. Yeah, so I get bounced off of the 5 car with a push from the 3. Actually, no, not a push from the 3, but then I accidentally... The 5 comes up a little bit and then I get hit on the outside wall. Well, I did not really give him that much room either, so it was just like a racing incident. So then, this guy in the back who had lost the draft, we kept battling and we both caught up to the lead pack. So now it was backpack racing again. I think something happens here. Oh yeah, I also make a mistake there and then... Oh yeah, there was a crash right there. I made a mistake right there and then... So the purple car pushes the 5 car into the 3 car and they just go wrecking. And the 3 car is a hard hit to the inside wall. So the 3 gets collected and he hits right there. That's hard. So the caution waved and then... I was back up front. The purple car had the lead though. Then we went back racing. The 8 car did not really launch that much. 
The five made a move on the outside of me. This was supposed to be the halfway marker of the race. So then I give the eight a push and then we, and the eight clears the five, even though he had a run. So the pack catches up again. Then we're back pack racing. I got a push from the four car. I think he was a lap down at this moment. So he just pushes me. Well, that car just blinked again. He blocks me and then I get some draft from him and then I make a move on the outside of him. I think this worked out for me. No, I don't think it did. So I get a push from the four car. Well, he did not really push me actually. So then I think I leave this lap. Yeah, I do. So then I push the four car. We just keep racing. I think this might be a, one of the crash laps. Yeah. So the five got a huge run. He hit the eight car. Oh, and it was like the next lap they wrecked. But he moves him out of the way. He hits me. He comes down on me like multiple times and we just keep making contact. It was on the back straightaway this lap, I'm pretty sure. So the 8 gets a run off the corner. Oh wait, it's not this lap. Sorry about that. So then the 5 clears me. I push him, but then he goes under the track. He breaks and then we both make a mistake. That was a huge hit there. The 5 hit the 3 car. I make a move on the inside of him. Yeah, it's. I'm pretty sure it's this lap they wreck. So the five gets a huge run on the three car, and then I think they. So he just puts him in the outside wall, and they both crash. And then I also get hooked by the eight car. So we went to a caution. The second to last caution, but the last caution will be interesting, to say the least. So then, the, the leader pitted, and then, so the five car just wrecks the four car, who is a lap down. He blinks again. Watch what he does to the next car in line. So the three car is on the lead lap. He hits him. Like, he actually hits the three car. So, the eight pushes him, and then they just wreck. And the eight thinks the five, I mean, the three thinks the five did it, but it was the eight who pushed him. So, then later... Later, he just goes, and the four car gets retaliation for that incident. He just comes in and wrecks him. And the eight car just, he just gets into the eight car while catching up to me. So then he just gets to the two car, I mean the three car and just tries to wreck him for no reason. I think this might have been the one to green moment, like one lap to go into the green flag. Yeah, so the, I think the pace car comes off. Yeah, it does. So the five gets to the three car, we go racing. Then the five just catches up and then wrecks him. And then this was the final caution. The eight barely avoided the three car and then... Wait, I did not see that though. The four catches back up again to the five and then... 
just wrecks him. This is the final caution. This time by it's it's gonna be the two overtime. So then we just go under caution. The eight car swerves a lot, and then here's the final two laps. So I get. It. So the five car is right on my bumper. It's the, oh, the last two laps, and then I just go racing. The five is right behind me there. The eight is in third place. So then the five just tries to pass on the inside immediately, or he does not. He's try to, he tries to run the outside line, and then he actually does it. Meanwhile, the eight car is coming in like really fast. He does a slingshot to the outside. So then I get a run on the five car. So this time by it's gonna be the white flag, and then I push him horribly. He gets kind of squirrely there, and it's, this is a white flag lap. I kind of get airborne there from the five car. So I push him to the lead, and then I try to make a pass exiting two with the run I get. Then the eighth car, I think he was gonna push me, but then he just goes for it. And I make contact, and he pushes the five. Then the three car is good at fake pushing me, and then he just goes to the inside. The eight pushes the five car, and then the eight just slingshots at the final moment. The three just wants to push the eight car because the five car wrecked him. But the five car wins. So that was the Thanksgiving 30.0. I hope you guys enjoyed it. And the 8 car has a horrific crash at the ending. The 4 car also targets the 5 car again. So, thanks for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And that, those were the race highlights of the Thanksgiving 30.0. This Thursday, it's going to be the Season 1 Championship for the NSCS from Mi Miami and Michigan.